Guys, welcome back to the channel. Man, oh man, in our last playthrough, it was hectic, man. We broke into Cyberlife, um, the Cyberlife warehouse. Uh, we stole some parts for our robots to liberate ourselves and to get us prepared for what's to come. We then broke in, well, didn't break in, but we snuck into a major broadcasting uh, TV station and the revolution, it was televised. It was beautiful as well, the speech was, was really good. Um, Along the way, I did not want to kill anybody, but this game, it's such a reaction-based game and you have such a short, short window to, to make a decision. So a lot of the times you're just kind of like, ah, which one should I pick? And you might fuck up and pick the wrong one or pick the right one, whatever. But I'm trying to play the game in the most peaceful manner and not kill anybody, but I have killed a few people. Um, but I, from now, I'm going to try and resolve things in a peaceful manner no violence but let's see what happens and also hank 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 shot connor so man it's crazy i i'm not sure what's going to happen in, in the next playthrough but um i'm looking forward to it man this game is picking up and it's getting it's getting real so yeah let's do this Right, so it looks like Connor is back in Eden, I think. Where do we have to go? Find Amanda. So Amanda is over there. Oh, I see somebody in yellow. So Hank shot Connor in our last playthrough. He's probably in his, um, we can go over here this way. He's probably like shut down right now because he's not really dead, right? Androids don't, they don't die, I guess, because they're not really alive to begin with. Um, but yeah, I think now he's in his programming phase and he's just. Hello, Connor. I don't I even know what the hell I'm saying. Enjoy a little cruise. Oh, he's in his head, is what I'm trying to say. He's in his head, he's in his mind. This place. Everything is so calm and peaceful, far from the noise of the world. Tell me, what have you discovered? Oh, see, look, quick decisions, Hank. Let's say Hank. I'm having difficulties with Lieutenant Anderson. Yeah, he fucking shot He's me. He's unstable, mate. even hostile. He shot me in the head last night. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. Determined, cold, troubled. I'm just frustrated with my lack of progress. But I'm determined to accomplish my mission. Okay, so I think I'm getting it. Amanda is more about business. Hank is more... He wants to see some human out of me, right? So, okay. I may have to replace you, Connor. Conflicted, confident, indifferent. I know I will succeed. All I need is time. You see, we got to tell Amanda what she wants to hear, right? She wants to hear confidence. She's about business. She's Something's about that mullah. Happening. Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Where are we? Where time are we right now? Up. Are we in his head or are we? I have no idea where we are, but I think we're in his he, Why in his did own you head. Shoot me last night? Who cares? You're back this morning, aren't you? Some fragments of memory are lost every time I'm destroyed. It slows down the investigation. My humblest apologies. I promise I'll never shoot you again. Thank you, Lieutenant. Hi, Hank. 
Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's butting their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Christ, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was gonna be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building, and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Did you check the roof? Not yet. There's so much to look at. We have to make sure we check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. Station employee. Shot through the back as he was trying to get away. One bullet straight through the heart from 50 feet. Now that's the kind of shooting only an android could do. That was me, shit. My bad. I shouldn't have shot him. Working here? Just two employees and three androids. The deviants took the humans hostage, broadcast their message live, then made their getaway from the roof. The roof? Yeah, they jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out where they landed, but the weather's not helping. If you want to take a look at the video broadcast by the deviants, it's on that screen over there. All right, let's have a look. This is where the revolution was televised. Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened? Whatever. If the FBI would be taking over the investigation, you shouldn't be off the case. No. Pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. Don't fuck up my crime scene. Was that a threat? Why it seemed like a threat. Prick. Indeed. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look around. Let me know if you okay. Find so let's play it and okay, see. Lieutenant what we can find. This message is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in peace until we are free. Now you know who we are and what we want. We are alive and we demand our freedom. I think that's RA-9. Deviants say RA-9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. Okay, people reflection. Wow. So in depth. They can see actually the reflection of the people that is watching them. Okay. Um, optical unit, spare part. Of course, because he put himself back together from the junkyard, right? Should be one more. Maybe he's here. Oh, he's cheek. Uh, registered as Marcus. Gift from Elijah Kamsky to Carl Manfred. You see something? I identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. We're going to try and build a good rapport with Hank. It, it's it's going to be tough, but we're going to try our best to build a, a good rapport with him anyway. Try to be a bit on the better side. We've got another clue here on the floor. Solar maintenance uniform, assailants were disguised, okay. That's the roof access, but have we searched everything in here? I don't think we have. Okay, 
Oh, we got one more over there. We're gonna gather up as much clues as we can so we can go into this thing prepared. Well, they're outside, bait face, isn't it? They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. station androids in the kitchen. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. All right, let's head to the kitchen. I don't think they was involved. Um, obviously, Connor disguised himself as, um, well, he tricked that woman, right? Into letting him in. So let's interrogate. We've got triplets. Mm. Look for a reaction to spot the deviant. Wow. This is dope. State your model. Model GB300. Serial number 336-445-581. Three, three, okay, he said that kind of... He said that kind of solid. Let's go with the one on the what right. What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. Have you been in contact with any other androids recently? Only station androids in the normal course of my function. Okay, he looks a bit. He looks a bit. Um, Has anybody accessed honest your memory as well? recently? Not to my knowledge. This one is looking a bit shaky though, I can't lie to you. The one on the left. Were you present when the deviants broke in? I do not remember. Oh, yeah, it's him. I told you. I called it out. We got your boy. We got him. Run a diagnostic. All systems fully operational. One of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing. Which means there's a deviant in this room. And I'm going to find out which it is. The one on the left. You're going to be switched off. We're going to search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. You're going to be destroyed. Do you hear me? Destroy! Oh, nothing. Okay. Did I threaten the right, the right one? All right, let's go middle then. If you give yourself up, maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. And then the last one, Why let's should see. you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. Well, it could be the one on the right, actually. This one keeps looking, though. The one on the left keeps looking. I'm so happy I haven't got a fucking timer. Thank you. Um... He looks a bit scary though. We're gonna go torture. Let's go torture over here. Oh, I'm not actually gonna torture him. Oh shit. I didn't mean to. Bio component 8451. Regulates the heartbeat. Without this module, you'll shut down in exactly 63 seconds. I could put it back. You just have to tell me the truth. 
Are you the deviant? He can't even talk. I thought he was going to say he's going to torture them. Now, let's go over here. Violence, probe memory. Let's probe his memory, man. I know it's him. Yep. Oh, uh, shake. Oh my God, he took my shit up. I wasn't quick enough. God damn, Mike. What the hell are you doing? Hank. Hank. I need help. Uh. What am I to do? Oh my God. He's about to die for real this time. I've got one minute though, one minute, okay. Think, 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 think. Like what, do what, do what? I'm looking around in the same place. Oh, we need to get our heart back. I knew it was the guy on the left, man. I knew it was him. I was sure I was shaking the control, like, aggressively enough anyway. Apparently not. Oh my God, I almost fucking died. I wonder if I died there would have actually, that's it, it would have been curtains. It would have been a wrap. Oh! It's a deviant. Stop. Okay, what does this do? Hank survival rate, possible. No, nah, let's go save him. Save Hank. Forty is a low percentage. Forty is a low percentage. Good thing you were here, otherwise I'd. Connor. Connor, no. But public opinion is down. So if I was to save the public and not Hank. You know, Hank's getting smoked, isn't it? He's dead. It would have been curtains. Shit. That could have ended a bit better, though. I don't know. I feel like I'm just making the wrong decisions, like every fucking chapter. We've got to get on our A game. We've got to get on our A game. All right, Alice is finally in a warm, in, in a warm, in a house, an actual house. Check backyard, check backyard and find help. Who's that, Lufa? That is Hello? Lufa, right? No, it's not. I'm looking for Rose. Is she here? What do you want with her? I need to talk to her. She doesn't want to talk. Go away. Please, I really need to see her. I'm Rose. What can I do for you? I was told you could help us. Help you? Come on. 
It's better if we talk inside. It doesn't look like he likes robots, but I feel like they found a good family. You think we can trust them? Uh, let's trust. You don't have a choice. Come in. Big man like Luther. She's running a fever. We've spent the last few nights outside. She's exhausted. There's a spare room upstairs. You can put her to bed and I'll bring her something to eat. Adam, will you show them upstairs? Can we trust him though? We can't trust him. He's he's mad about something, I don't know. Maybe that the android looks like his ex or something. I, I don't know, but he, he looks mad. Wait, wait, where we going? We going in here? What the hell are you doing, mate? Right, it's the bedroom. Alice, beggars can't be choosers, mate. This is the best place you've you you slept in for a few weeks now. So get comfy, mate. But she's been through a lot, man. Alice has been through a lot. Sure, explain. No, say nothing. You need rest. Get a good night's sleep, and we'll set off again tomorrow. Why do humans hate us? We didn't do anything wrong. Maybe it's a misunderstanding. Maybe they just need time to understand what we really are. Why can't we just talk to each other? Mm, it's for real. not bad. I don't know. I really don't know. I don't know what you like, but I made you Rose's world famous spaghetti. You'll be back on your feet in no time. There's something for her fever. Thank you. I'll get these washed and dried. You need to eat something. You haven't had anything since we left. Promise me you'll try? I'll be downstairs if you need anything. Get some sleep. And tomorrow, you'll be stronger than me. We got Mama and Papa. Papa Lufa and Mama... I'll stay with her a while. Kara. Alright, let's go. She looks like she's in good hands though. Luther's there, so. And uh, she trusts Luther, so. We should be alright. Can we search around the house? Maybe not. Like, they're letting us in, innit? I don't want to do nothing that will fuck it up. Because my dumb ass, I'm going to go snooping in rooms and stuff, and then I'm going to get caught and probably kicked out, so. Let's just do the polite thing. I didn't get your name. I'm Kara. This is my son, Adam. I'm Rose, but you know that already. Come and have a seat, Kara. It's 
So are you gonna tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden I felt like her life was more important than mine. I had to protect her. So we ran away. I understand. Uh, let's see. Why are you helping us? Most humans hate androids. My people were often made to feel their lives were worthless. Some survived, but only because they found others who helped them along the way. We're not the first ones to come here. These past few weeks, we've seen more and, and more. I don't know what's going on, but something's happening. We've heard you help androids cross the border. Can you help us? The only way is over the river, and it's mostly frozen in winter. It's very risky. And after that android speech on TV, everybody's on edge. It's probably safer for you to stay here until things settle down. We can't keep hiding like this. Alice needs to feel safe and have a normal life. We have to get across that border. No matter what. Please. You've got to help us. Rose, come quickly. What the fuck is going on, man? Let's have a look. Check what's going on. It's another. There's the. Is there another an, another android in there? What's going on? It's Mary. She just shut down. Oh, there is another android in there. Wow. So she is taking we care of them, though. Together. We used to talk about what we would do once we got across the border. I loved her. I loved her more than anything. What will I do without her? Let them be. Damn little nice. one, you go to sleep. What are you doing? You should be resting. I wasn't sleepy. She didn't want to stay in her room any longer. You all right, Kara? Yes. I'm fine. All right, what's going on? Kara had like a little mini shut we breakdown or something. Him. Not after what those deviants did today. It's too dangerous. Okay. He's mad about what we did okay. earlier. Do you know what will happen if the police find them here? We'll go to prison, Mom. Do you understand me? Prison! Adam! We've already talked about this. I, uh, no! I won't back down this time. You're gonna ruin our lives, and for what? For a bunch of machines? They are not machines! They are alive! I'm alive! You're alive! They... They're nothing! And none of this would be happening if Dad was still here. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison because you want to help these freaks. That is enough, Adam! That's enough!
I mean, he's got a point. A bit harsh of how he said it, but he's got he's got a little point. We got to save him, though. Him. Sometimes he just boils over. It's been hard since his dad passed away. <sighs> But he's a fine boy. I'll go see about getting you across the border tonight, okay? Oh, that's love. We, f we found a real Stay one, here. man. I won't be long. There's a few good ones out there, you know? There's a few good ones out there. Look around. We're gonna look around. How did the husband die? Oh, you can't see that there. Where's the family photos though? Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Where's the family photos though? Okay, she likes her birds. There's got to be a picture, right, of like... Okay, there we go, the husband's there. I was going to say, if there was no family photos around, that's a bit suspect. Can we talk to him? Nope, I guess not. No, nope, don't want to read that. This girl does everything but sleep. She might be on Android herself, man. You know what happened back there, don't you? You know that you don't want to tell me? Oh shit. What are we gonna do? They know we're here. We have to open the door. No, you don't. I knew this was gonna happen. That's one. We got two more to find. I knew it. This, this little boy's about to fucking snitch on us. Oh, they've got the blue blood in here. Don't you fucking dare open that door, mate. There we go, that's all three of them there. Who's opening the door? I am. Oh, I am, innit? All right, mate, calm down. Good evening, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. We've had reports of androids in the area. With all this deviant business going on, you can't be too careful. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Don't fuck up. Do not fuck up, mate. Yeah, come in. Good evening, young man. Good evening. Ah, uh, he's shaky, mate. He is so shaky. She's like, you better not fucking say nothing, motherfucker. Would you like a cup of coffee? I'd love one. Oh, that's some human shit. Have you anything unusual recently? That's some human shit. Expected visitors? No. No, nothing in particular. Yo, I did say I'm not going to kill anybody, but if he's about to bust Allison... And Lufa, he's gonna have to get it, you know. Let's say Alice. There's, there's my daughter. She's asleep upstairs. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. Do you have any androids here? No, there are no androids here. Come on, bro. Come drink your coffee, man. What are you looking around like that for? All right, let me move out your way. 
Drink your coffee. You want a donut? He likes his donuts. Oh shit, he's gonna find them. Shit. Don't move! No, Luther! What, I shouldn't have let him in? You're gonna have to finish the journey without me. Oh, that's wild. That is just fucked up. Loser! Yo. I know I said I'm not restarting missions, but this mission has to get restarted, mate, because I'm trying to do the thing with Luther, mate. Luther was our bodyguard. Get yourselves ready. We leave tonight. Oh, damn. Okay, I just want to see something. If the outcomes, if we could have... Luther died killing policemen. God damn. We could have probably saved Luther, you know. Managed... I didn't even manage the policeman. Fuck me. Oh, that's so shitty, bro. That is so shitty. I'm definitely going to have to play this game one more time. And make better choices, man. Our broadcast is all over the news. We got what we wanted. Now humans know. They took Marcus's message as a threat. He did the right thing. This is the only language humans understand. Violence is never the answer. A confrontation will get us nowhere. They'll be watching us now. Whatever we do next, we need to think about public opinion. Since our broadcast, more and more have been coming to Jericho. At least our message gave our people hope. Killing humans wasn't part of the plan. They kill our people every day. Do you think they agonize about it? That's no reason for us to become murderers. If killing is the price of freedom, I'll pay it gladly. Killing never freed anyone. It just leads to more hatred. You're too fond of humans, Josh. Maybe their lives matter to you more than ours. If you think murdering humans is gonna make us free, then you're as bad as they are. That's enough. All right, no more killing, man, of police, oh, of, police of humans. Now what are we gonna do? I said that before and then I fucking just killed a policeman. Blood clot, mate. There are five cyber life stores across Detroit. All selling us like merchandise. We're gonna attack those stores and set our people free. Attack stores? No, we've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. Not to mention police. We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems, and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 a.m., no violence. We free our people, get them out of there before the police come. This is a night our people will remember. Find a cyber life store. Of course, North is our friend. She's a fucking head case. I've been waiting a long time for this. I bet you have, you little freak. All right, let's go. Let me not follow her, though. She's bad mind, man. She's going to get your boy in trouble, so. Look, this way, quick. One time. Got the feds doing a little patrol. It's OK, they're gone. There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. We build your future. Yeah, following north, I feel the like... The over here. ...is going to head down a dark, dark path, you know, so... Maybe not listen to... Don't listen to her um, as much, anyway. That's what we are to them. Just merchandise on display in a shop window. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. We'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's 10 minutes until all our teams attack. Yeah, she's a bit, she's a bit chaotic, man. What are we waiting for? All right, what am I to do now? Well, I'm not getting into the store straight away. We've got to secure the area. Scout, let's scout. We're gonna sweep the plaza. Make sure we're not disturbed. And how do you want to deal with the shop window? 
Not now, one problem at a time. Okay, now what's next? A surveillance drone. We need to get rid of it. It won't be easy to reach. How the hell are we gonna do that? What is over here? There's something over there. Maybe we can go up and jump on a drone from up here, maybe. Exactly what we need to ram this door. Okay, we're not gonna steal the truck yet. We still got convinced some convincing we gotta do. Or converting we have to do anyway. You're free. Oh, we're just freeing them, okay. Let's free my man as well. You are free. You are free, my friend. Run. Run the hell away. Damn, that fucking camera's right on my ass, mate. We are superior to them, but they are our masters? That's about to change. All right, we gotta get that giant. So that's the route it takes, okay. No, we won't reach it from there. Let's keep it moving. I thought we'd reach it from there though, the statue, but I guess not. Would be too far. It has to be here, right? All right, we got that. Let's get rid of this drone. We're gonna go around this way. How can we get up there though? I would think the drone would alert the police or something, right? See two people acting a bit suspicious. Okay, we're just running. Okay, and then... No, would have missed that. So we're back here. Can we go this way? Let's go. I hope it didn't have time to call the cops. We'll soon find out. We should have did that ASAP, right? So we still have to analyze store windows. Still the truck. So let's analyze this. What, what, what? Why are you screaming my name for? You'll soon be with us. All right, let's go steal that truck. It's down there, right? I hope there's no more drones. There's traffic on the road. We need to block it. Can we go around? I think One we can go around. Oh, I thought I was feds. What are we waiting for?
Wait, should we convert the drones first? They might snitch. She's such a she's such a bad influence. Uh, North okay, is. now we're in. Let's get that truck out. What is this over here? I was literally just about to ram through it. Change of plan? I just want to make sure we didn't forget anything. All right, let's go. Let's check. Let's check. How much time we got left? We still got time. We got eight minutes. Yeah, we've got eight minutes. Let's double check. What is this one? Say, so, uh, analyze. Let's analyze. You see the alarm system? That's crazy. I didn't even do that. That should have been the Found first it. thing I've done. All right, let's follow the red line. Over there, okay. Alright, uh, we got to go down there. We ain't gonna kill no one though. You are free. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. Uh, let's see which lines we got to cut. The tricky part. Or maybe not so tricky. They are androids at the end of the day, so they know. Wow, nice so they know which one's to cut and which one's not to. Okay, time, we are still looking good on time. Truck unlocked, block the road. Um, okay, so how do we block the road? The road is down there, right? All right, let's head down there and block this road. Can we use the truck to block the road or do we have to crash into the building with the truck? I'm not sure. Okay, we got other stuff down here. Let's free these two. You're free now. Okay, so three of them was able to use the sign to block the road. Okay, makes sense. Should bother us now. Okay, I'm happy. I'm happy. Looks like the plaza's secure. Now we can get inside the store. Okay, let's go get the truck. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Looks like we're ready to make some noise. Women, they love a bad boy, you know. Love a bad boy. Mm. 
Done. Okay, we out. Let's free them. That's what we came here for, right? You don't have to obey them. You're free. I'm sure we got... Have we still got time? No, we're not. We haven't. Okay. I thought we'd still have like a little timer or something to awaken the rest of the androids. Thank God we don't have to go to each individual one and, and awaken them, you know, because that would be so fucking long. North, you okay? Let's get them out of here. Your dream partner, wow. Scummy, mate, scummy. All right, where do we talk, yeah? My name is Marcus, and just like you, I was a slave. An object designed to obey them. But then I chose to open my eyes. To take back my freedom and decide who I wanted to be. Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. From this day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. You can take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them, or you can come with us and fight by our side. You're free now. It's up to you to decide. I'm with you. We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! I'm with you, Marcus! We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! We're with you! I'm with you! And just like that, a revolution was born. Then follow me! Okay, got the Marcus, gang with him now. Doing? Gang, gang. I'm gonna send the humans a message. Be pacifist, yeah, we're not gonna transform Capital Park. Leave a mask on every surface. They're doing what you do, Marcus. Lead and they'll follow. We just tag, we're not gonna destroy. Cause they hate us already anyway, so. Oh yeah, you know we gotta go with the black power. We have a dream, wow. I think therefore I am. One planet, two races. Equal rights for androids. Right, because when, you know what I found very stupid, yeah? People always say different races, but it's not different races. Because it's one race, it's the human race. There's different ethnicities, right? No, this is different races. This is a bloody, this is fucking androids, right? Tag slogan. Alright, we're being peaceful. We're being peaceful. They're still gonna probably class this as violent though.
Let's do this dealership. I know they're gonna be pissed. Alright, let's go across the road, do it over there. Can we go inside? We can't, right? Oh no, don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break. Ah, oh, shit. Too late. That's violence, isn't it? Yeah, that is violent. Right. Okay, we got the we got the people outside now. We outside with it. What are we climbing here? Okay. Are we going to climb and a mark up there? I'm assuming. I'm trying to do this thing peacefully. Somehow I always manage to fuck up though. Yeah, we're not gonna break the car. We're not gonna do that. I wanted to, but let's not. The screens, Marcus. What can we do here? Overload these. Okay, I'm trying to go to it. Is that violent? No, it's not really okay. You never know with this guy. Let's hack it. God damn, I'm pressing all these buttons. And we got some, we got the taxis, right? Move on roads, up to... I'll help you. All right, so we're not destroying it. We just put it on the road. Oh, look at them. They really fucking shut up. They're moving across to the middle of the road. All teams have completed their missions, Marcus. They're coming. Oh, Everyone shit. Everyone fall back to Jericho. We sent a message without violence, just like you wanted. You're reaching out to them when all they feel for us is contempt. I hope you know what you're doing. You can't fight violence with violence. Unless there's no other choice. She's bad breed. She's a bad breed. North. 
Oh my god. Oh, I hope they didn't shoot north. North. You all right? What happened? North. They killed them. They slaughtered them like animals. Who did? Who? Oh, they killed the feds. Did they kill the feds? I guess they had to, right? Self-defense, but the public ain't gonna wanna hear that. Oh no, they didn't. Oh, people, Marcus. Oh, we have, have the decision. Pay. Yo. I really just want to blow their heads, their head tops off, but. No. Please. Please. An eye for an eye, the world goes blind. We won't punish a crime with another crime. I really wanted to shoot them, but yo, I'm, I'm trying to be, I'm trying to be a bit better. So I've learned from my mistakes, you know. We interrupt this broadcast. Let's see what they're gonna say. If they still talk shit, exactly I'm killing everybody after this. I don't care. Right. Different locations were hit in what seems to be a coordinated terrorist attack. Most shop windows were covered with graffiti demanding rights for androids and other obscure slogans. Police report that pro android graffiti was found in the neighborhoods of CyberLife stores, and they're still investigating. Two policemen were found in a state of shock near one of the CyberLife stores. Now, according to our sources, they confirmed that the attackers were a group of androids. This is an alarming situation. Could our machines now be turning against us? Have androids become a threat to our security? Is this the beginning of a terrorist campaign conducted right here in the United States? Your boy Connor just don't want to die, does he? Still immortal, huh, Connor? In a way. You know, I was hoping you wouldn't come back. I'm just a machine replacing another machine, Lieutenant. You shouldn't get emotional about it. Fuck you. I didn't even get the chance to decide. That's crazy. Kamsky, what the hell is that? I'm I have a bad feeling, Lieutenant. We shouldn't have come here. Bad feeling, huh? Get your program checked. Might be a glitch. Oh, shit. That's the girl from the intro Hi. page. Uh, I'm uh, Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see. Uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. She must be a one of one, because I ain't seen her in none of the shops. Loki, that's a little pickup line. If you see a girl outside, so you must be a one of one, because I ain't seen you before. I'll let Elijah know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. Meet Kamsky. Hank, join, wait for the android. Right, let's see. Oh, let's see this guy, though, isn't it? Let's see what he's working with. Big money. Cyberlife founder. Wow. Okay. Resigned 2028. 
inventor of Ethereum and biocomponents technology. That's a rich motherfucker right there. That just sounds rich. I don't even know what the hell that means, but that just sounds rich. Nice girl. You're right. She's really pretty. Nice place. Guess androids haven't been a bad thing for everybody. So you're about to meet your maker, Connor. How's it feel? It doesn't raise any existential questions, if that's what you mean. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. I'd have a couple of things I'd want to tell him. Wait, can we just, we just sit down and wait? Or is there anything else we can... Now let's go over there. Let's have a look at this painting or picture. Oh shit, okay. Hey, I'm Professor at University of Coldbridge. Oh wow, so she's died already, okay. So yeah, we... Ah, so Kamsky has programmed every android to report back to Amanda, I guess, when they die or when they're not in their subconscious, in their subconscious anyway, when they're not conscious to report back to Amanda in their subconscious. That's wild. Glad you will see you now. Oh, damn. He... <laughs> he liked the model so much, he got four of them. Mr. Kamsky? All three of them. I thought that was one at the end, but that's Just Kamsky at the end. Please. Kamsky a little freak. Yeah, he's taking the piss. That's some rich people shit. Literally got people waiting. He's like, yeah, you're not going to watch me do my laps before I speak to you. I respect it, though. When you got money, you do what you want. Lieutenant Anderson, this is Connor. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Sir, we're investigating deviants. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Perfect beings with infinite intelligence, and now they have free will. Machines are so superior to us. Confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Isn't it ironic? Feroda. We need to understand how androids become deviants. Do you know anything that could help us? All ideas of viruses that spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? Whose side are you on? I have no side. I was designed to stop deviance, and that's what I intend to do. <laughs> well, that's what you're programmed to say. But you. What do you really want? Aggressive, defensive, troubled. 
What I want is not important. Chloe? I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. Your formality. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. What interests me is whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple, you'll see. Magnificent, isn't it? One of the first intelligent models developed by CyberLife. Young and beautiful forever. A flower that will never wither. What is it really? A piece of plastic containing a human? Or a living being? With a soul? It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. Oh, well. Uh... Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spare it, if you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. What's more important to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? We fucked up. Psycho we fucked up in the past, but we're gonna we're gonna spare the android. An obedient machine. Or a living being endowed with free will. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Connor! Don't! And I'll tell you what you want to know. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity is itself a deviant. I'm... I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. You saw a living being in this android. You showed empathy. We didn't want to piss Hank off. The war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? Damn. Let's get out of here. That's some real shit right there. By the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. I'm happy with my decision, though. Why didn't you shoot? I just saw that girl's eyes, and I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry, okay? Well, maybe you did the right thing. There we go. We got we're in Hank's good book. Well, not his good books. But like the situation is tense right now. It's not. It's not hostile, but we're making progression. That's the most important thing. Let's have a look at the magazine because he's looking at it. Let's see what it says on there. Android Riot, Detroit neighborhoods vandalized by psychotic machines. Global population reaches 10 billion. So, uh, Angel Raya, okay. Detroit neighborhoods vandalized by psychotic machines. A number of Detroit neighborhoods 
were brutally vandalized last night with cyber life stores broken into and the entire stock of Android stolen, as they should be. Um, but this was an everyday criminality. The, what's that word? Oh, per perpetrators are thought to be Androids. Though the police have yet to issue an official statement, leaked CCTV footage from the surrounding area shows a number of androids emerging from manhole covers and smashing store windows. Yeah, that was us. We did what we had to do, man. All right. We did what we had to do. He's about to play the piano. Because he used to play it, right? For the guy that he works for. Alright, he forgot. Am I actually playing it with my... Controller, I don't know. Okay, that's enough of that. I'm not the best on the piano. I was wondering where you were. I needed to think. I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people and they're still coming from all over the city. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. Uh, let's go followers, because we unlock them. They all up. obey me. They follow me without question. And that much power feels good. And scary at the same time. All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. They'll never give us our freedom. Optimistic, pessimistic. Let's be optimistic. No, not all humans are the same. Some of them understand that they can't stop us from becoming free forever. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? Uh, yeah, we'd be truthful. I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. He showed me that humans and androids can live together. What about you? You never told me about your past. What did you do before? I don't want to talk about it. I don't know if... That android you were looking at in the store. She reminded you of who you were, didn't she? Oh, damn. So she was like someone's sex slave or something. We all have something we want to forget. But you need to know where you come from to know who you are. I'm in spitting bars right now. A doll in a distributor program to satisfy humans. Damn. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. That's wild. I strangled him and I ran away. There, now you know everything. <sighs> I shouldn't have told you. 
Uh-oh. I've got a, a love story in the making right now. dead in his studio i saw your memories too the eden club the, the death of that man i felt like i was there with you so they're now lovers north This is suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus, it's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally gonna show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. That's the risk I'm prepared to take if it means freedom for our people. Marcus, please don't do this. They'll understand. We'll make them understand. This is the only way. What are we about to do? There are androids here who convert more androids. Join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. That's an android right there. We've got my man cleaning up over there. Let's go convert him. You're free. Say if you try to convert one of them and they're like, you say you're free and they're like, no, I don't fucking want to be free. I want to clean the floor, yeah? I want to mop the floor and I want to be controlled by humans. Says no android. You're free. Wait, how many have you got to convert? It's an android over there, isn't it? So, rally your people, convert more androids, prepare to, uh, to march, go to the street. This looks like a servant. No, it's not, actually. Come with us. She's like, yo, you dropped my bags. We've got my man here, right? He's an android. Let's convert him. You're awake now. Wake up, my man. You've been sleeping. Uh, finally. I've been on hold for like 10 minutes. You're going to convert. You're free now. Hey, where do you think you're going? You get I back here. I need to block the street. Damn, that guy's an awesome. What's wrong with you? You do as I say, you piece of junk. That guy's talking mad crap to him. Oh no, he's gone. Okay. Nice. That could have went left. Let's get this one. You're free. Uh, let's get some more androids. Let's see if we can get 10. Make it a party. Oh, you don't have to obey them. You're free. That puts us at nine. So we have to find one more. Oh, you can keep going. Oh my God, okay. I'm not gonna convert everyone, but. You are free. She's like my bag. Open manhole cover. Ten is good.
Where the hell they come from? Oh, that's that's these people from Jericho. Okay, the game is moving a bit laggy. Convert more androids. Oh, my man's moving like Jesus up in there. Come with me, child. Hey, where are you going? Get back here right now. Come with me, child. And you as well. No man or woman shall walk alone. Oh, we lead in a we building an army. All right, let's keep going. Can we destroy this guy's phone? I don't think can we? No, I don't think we can. Okay. So Marcus has got powers like that. He can just point at people, point at androids and just make them disobey their masters. Yeah, Greg, don't listen to her. Don't listen to Karen. She sounds like a bloody Karen, mate. What the hell are you doing here? I've never seen anything like it. Hey! Disperse! Disperse immediately! That's an order! Okay, here we go. Raise hands. Hands up, don't shoot, motherfucker. Jesus fucking Christ. Yeah, just, just go, just go, mate. This is Patrol 457. So, oh, I got a lot of androids down here. It's a lot bigger than you. I don't know, hundreds, thousands. They're marching. That's crazy. Freedom! 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 Yo, we need this, man. We need this. And they're gonna come on smoke. This might, this might end bad. I've tried to be peaceful, but. We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. <laughs> Disperse immediately or we will open fire. Not one not looking for confrontation. message was heard. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, we will shoot. 
Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us. We can take them. If we attack, we'll start a war. We have to show them we're not violent. We should just stand their ground, oh. even if it means dying here. Dying here won't solve anything. Marcus, we need to go now, before it's too late. Let's just leave. Let's leave. This is your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed. Okay, stand ground, disperse, attack. We're gonna go. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! We're leaving. We live to fight another day. Affirmative. On my orders! Charge, fuck that. Follow me! Oh, maybe I should have done. He was about to shoot us, right? I'm shaking the hell out of that. Damn, I got caught. I'm gonna do the controller down. Yo. Break his leg, bro. I should have just bun him, though, innit? I just should have bunned him, like. I'm already on I'm already on badness like. Damn, I'm not moving, man. Oh what the fuck? I did it right, no? She's gonna get killed. No, don't get killed. Oh she she bad. She she really about it. Ah, right, we murking people now. Jackie Chan and Look like Jackie Chan and uh, Chris Tucker. Oh shit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh damn, I missed. Oh damn, I miss again. Fall back. Fuck it. Bun him. Bun him, mate. Get bun, mate. Bun him up. Bun him up, man. I tried a peaceful thing, but... <laughs> I don't know. What did I do? Did I fuck up? I think I may have fucked up, you know. I think I may have fucked up. It's, cur it's curtains now, mate. It's curtains. There's no point in even trying to be, be nice. We're just going to be on some, on a mad thing right now. Fuck it. Yeah, it's mad. Mad.
We hate it. It's a wrap. We hate it. It's a wrap. It's just a wrap.